Check out the clips from this episode at InsideCouture.com. Let's talk about fashion on Twitter at Inside Couture. Go to Inside Couture on Facebook and click like to show your support for Inside Couture. Hi, this is Anna Kraft, Inside Couture, and we're backstage with the famous Beverly Peel. And um, welcome to Miami. We're so excited to have you Thank here. You. It's so hot down here. <laughs> it's wet, sticky heat, but I love it. I haven't been here in a long time. Miami so. is definitely sexy and hot. So tell us, um, tell us about your life and a little bit about your modeling career and just uh... my goodness there's so much ground to cover there uh, do we have enough time <laughs> maybe just um, well some I of the started highlights. when I was 12 and a half and um, took off from there just it was just like a world went up you know I was very fortunate to be blessed and with the photographers loved me and the designers loved me and you know blink of an eye I was supermodel Beverly Peel and got to travel everywhere and a lot of the dark sides of the business that people, you know, hear about mm -hmm. didn't really happen to me um, until later on in my in my career. Towards the end of it, I guess. Well, I don't want to say end because I'm still around and kicking and breathing, but towards the my hiatus, I would say. You know, um, uh, I was fortunate. I loved traveling. I loved working. I loved, you know, the experience that you get with it. Um, the knowledge. It's it's. You know, if they if they could bottle it up and, and put it as a course in school, then I would definitely tell people to to take that course. Mita, yes, that's what this is supposed to be, like a crash course with, you know, you have all the top people speaking and, and giving you a little bit of insight as to what you're about to get into. So I wish I had that, you know, back then. Right, I mean, back then we there was nothing out there. It was so just really your agents and your managers and your parents, And really. you believed them, they, yep. whether they knew the business or well, not. Well, I was, like I said, I was fortunate to have people who, who uh, since I was so young, I believe, that they took me under their wing and really watched me and made sure a lot of bad things didn't happen to me. And um, later on in life, when I wanted to branch off and do my own thing, that's when the, the bad choices came. So, and but not every model can get that, you know, attention and that, um, that foundation. Exactly. So I was like I said, a blessed. I'm, I count my blessings every day, and um, here I am, able to give back. Wonderful. <laughs> well, I'm sure everybody appreciates it. Uh, any new works that you're going into or projects for the future? That well, I'm um, in the process of. Uh, Speaking, well, we're at the first stage of I want to open up my own recovery center for, you know, people in the business, whether it's alcohol, uh, pills, drugs, um, eating, you know, fat, being fat and can't cope, um, just a place where they can go and get help so they can move on to their destiny and, and follow their dreams. And also I have a book that's in the works and of course being a mother is an everyday job. <laughs> um, we're right, you're a mother of three. three. Yes, a 19 year old, an 8 year old and a 17 month old. Oh, congratulations. Keep me busy. <laughs> and um, my daughter and I are trying, we're about to do our online magazine because she's going to school for photography. So and Tell us the name of that magazine. Oh, we don't know yet. Okay. We're, we're, we have it's like five works. different names yeah, we're just we're actually building the website as we speak, so there's no name yet. Wonderful. We're it looking might just be no it. name. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever you want to call it. <laughs> so tell us what um, part you're going to be today in this. Uh, I'm not. I'm really not sure what at what point I'm going to be on, but Tyrone asked me to come out here mm -hmm. and speak to give a little insight as to the like, first three years of modeling, um, what they can expect, and um, you know things to watch out for. I'm sure it's changed a lot since I was, you know, a younger little girl. Um, but pretty much it's the, it, it, it all in ties with each other as far as what to look out for in any industry, really, I, I believe. Um, so I'll be speaking on that, and hopefully they'll get some good, you know, good advice out of it. I don't know. I'm sure they will. Do as I needed. say, not as I do. <laughs> all right, so give us um, some tips or, or the most important tip if you have one. Always wash your face. No, I'm just kidding. Um, That's a good one. <laughs> just be confident in yourself and know, always go with your gut feeling. Always go with your gut and, it, you, you know, God is within yourself so he won't steer you wrong. Therefore, you won't steer yourself wrong. Don't. Other people are not you, so you have to follow what you believe, not what other people are telling you to believe. That is the most important thing I believe. I believe. You may not believe it. I'm just kidding. <laughs> just follow your gut, and you can't go wrong. Great tip. I think that can be applied in all aspects in all of life. In all aspects of life, definitely. Well, thank you so much, You're Beverly, welcome. for being here. You're welcome. Right. 
Hi, I'm Beverly Peel, and you're watching Inside Couture. Fashion is deep. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 